Hello and welcome to another unboxing review video for J5 Collectibles. This week we'll be taking a look at the Transformers Studio Series 77 Nest Bumblebee figure from the movie Bumblebee. And if you're interested in this figure, head on over to j5collectibles.com or come see us in store. We're open every Saturday and Sunday from 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. Come on over, hang out, shop toys, talk toys. We'll see you real soon. And before we get this figure in hand, let's take a quick look at the packaging. So we'll, here we have a clear front view of the figure, along with an illustration of Bumblebee transformed. Very nicely done there. Looking at the side there, you have Studio Series 77, as well as the image of Bumblebee in the gray color scheme there for this one. So there he is right there. There's your authentic Transformers logo. Transformers, Bumblebee movie. On the bottom, your blah, blah, blahs. On the back, you're going to have your product shots. There's his Jeep mode. All right, transforms in 26 steps. Also, you have a backdrop that it comes with. Pretty neat. So here you can see the figure itself, a uh, little accessory that it comes with, and then a blaster. Here's the backdrop. So it's nicely done, in typical Studio Series fashion. On the back it's just plain cardboard, and so here's your instructions it comes with. Uh, nothing new with these, they're fairly clear and simple instructions to follow. Uh, transformation on this guy is actually not that hard. It's really easy, really fun. Alright, so moving right along, here's also the other accessories he comes with. Uh, this little figure, it's supposed to be John Zena playing as uh, Agent Smith. Uh, not the best of molding use here, but it is what it is. All right, so here's his arm blaster. Pretty neat. It's just a solid piece of plastic there. Could have used some paint, but, you know, uh, it looks really good on him, as you can see right there. So here it is all together with the backdrop. Holding his blaster, we got a little figurine there, Agent Smith. Alright, so now let's take a quick look at the paint here in the molding. Uh, it's really nicely done here. I, I do like the little the green tint that they use for the windshield and uh, the headlights. It's pretty cool. All in all, the mold itself is pretty nice. It feels pretty solid and sturdy. Now, let's look at the articulation. So as you can see, his head can move up. And back down. Not too far down. Now he does have a little bit of um of movement there, but mostly just turn left, turn right, full 360 head swivel. And that's pretty much gonna be it for as far as the head. Now the shoulders can go all the way out. Now they can turn 360, full 360, however, the wheel is in the way of that. So you may want to be careful when moving him around because that could uh you know mess with the paint as far as uh when it rubs on there. Now the elbow um, can bend a little over 90 degrees. There is a swivel at the elbow as well. Now there is no wrist or hand articulation really. It's just fixed in the position like that. There is some waist swivel. So he can fully spin. Again, you just want to be uh, wary of the backpack that's in the way of that. can limit that, that movement a bit. So kicking up, uh, he has really good range of motion there, as well as kicking back. Uh, only limited due to that backpack he has there. Uh, as far as kicking out, can do the splits pretty well. Uh, so he can ninja kick. Uh, bend at the knee there, a little bit past 90 degrees. Now he does have some foot rocking here. He can rock forward, back. There is a little bit of side to side uh, tint, uh, tiltage there. So that's really nice. Alright, so next up, let's take a look at the transformation.
So here's the alt mode. It's Jeep. It looks really nice. Uh, the paint on it looks really good. I love the little red details. The green tint for the windshield looks great. It rolls just fine. Um, yeah, the wheels on this look great. So all in all, it's not really a bad alt mode. So there's your look at the Transformers Studio Series 77 Nest Bumblebee from the movie Bumblebee. Guys, comment down below. Tell me what you think of this figure. Uh, would you guys add this uh, EE exclusive release to your collection? Also, uh, if you enjoy this content and want to see more videos like this, please be sure to hit that like, share, subscribe button, comment down below. It really does help out a lot. Uh, guys, we greatly appreciate all the love and support you guys have been showing to the channel. Uh, also, give some love support over at the website. Support Pops for Patients, a really great cause. Uh, and, of course, guys, thank you so much for watching. Until next time.